on this video I'm going to be recommending some Glossier products that you should definitely try because I just love them and I know that you will as well. It's good for your skin, it enhances your beauty, and it's just easy to use, so why not? Hey guys, welcome back to Keeping Up With MJ. I'm MJ and I'm going to be telling you all about Glossier. If you don't know what Glossier is, if you love Glossier products and you want to see some new products from Glossier, if you're just curious to know what I'm doing, if you're just supporting me, I appreciate you all. Stay tuned for this video because I have a lot to chat with you about and show you guys the products on my face. What is Glossier? Glossier is a makeup and skincare company, so they're cruelty free and I believe their products, some of their products are vegan based. Um, so with Glossier, it's different to a lot of brands because the products that they make are very, very subtle. They make products to enhance your natural beauty and that's why I love them so much. So I've been a Glossier rep for a number of years right now. I don't even know how much years I've been a Glossier rep, but it's been a minute. I know a few things about their products. I have a lot of products that I love and I have some products that I don't really like that much. People DM me all the time and ask me like what products they should get if they're now starting out with makeup um, and what products I would recommend for them. And um, if you're one of those people, this video will be helpful for you. Okay, so disclaimer. No, I do not receive all free makeup from Glossier, like all the products I have are free. No, I am a Glossier customer just as much as I am a Glossier rep. So with being a Glossier rep, I get sent some products before it's launched to try it out and share with you guys, but also, I buy my own products, okay? <laughs> the commission that I make from my affiliate links are so, 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 so small. You're benefiting more from it than me. Trust me on that. So in this video, I'm gonna be doing a get ready with me using majority of Glossier products and the rest of products are other brands that you may know, you may love, okay? so. The first thing that I am going to start off using is Glossier's Milky Jelly Cleanser. This is one of the products that I will recommend to you because it's so good on the skin. Even if it gets into your eyes, it does not burn. You can use it as a cleanser or you can use it as a makeup remover. Majority of the times I use this product as a makeup remover because it gets off all of my makeup and it's really gentle on my skin. Today I'm going to use it as a cleanser to start off my routine. After you've done that, you get your towel and you just dry your face off. The next product that I'm going to use is Glossier's Priming Moisturizer. This product is very thick and creamy, so I take this much, I dab, dab, dab. The next thing that I'm going to go in with is my boy brow and my brow flick and my regular um, eyebrow pencil. These three products are what I use to do my brows. I am in no way, no shape or form a makeup artist, okay guys? So don't come for me on how I do my eyebrow. Um, the stretch concealer in Deep 40, okay?
things I've learned how to do over the years and it's been working for me so don't come for me <laughs> so I shade it in like so until I see that's a little until I see that it's full enough that's how I leave it um I usually would use my um, LA girl um, my LA girl pro concealer but it's finished but I like to just use the tip to um, shape up my brows so what I do is I go in with the uh, stretch concealer I dip this in it and then I just go around the outlines of my eyebrows And then I take my little sponge and I dab it out. just creates um, eyebrow strokes that let's say you have really patchy eyebrows and you just want to fill them in and make them look thick you can use the brow flick to do that I'm just going to do like a quick little um, line on my hand so that you can see what I'm talking about so it's really um, like eyeliner for your eyebrows Basically, these are my brows. Okay, these are my brows. Um, I love them. Um, and with the boy brow, it just completes it. And I just really love looking at them. They're thick and they're black and they're mine. Like, duh. <laughs> All right, so moving on to the next thing. A trick that I've learned to do with um, cloud paints is to mix them with future do so this is where I'm going to implement future do into my routine disclaimer if you're just doing a regular skincare um, day and you want to use future do use it as the last step in your skincare routine and um, I'm actually gonna have a video of that of later a, a bit later down 
but for now I'm just going to use Future Do with my topping. So what I do is just I squeeze a little bit to my hand, then I'm going to squeeze a bit of Storm on my hand, and then I'm going to squeeze a bit of Beam in my hand. Before I put on my cloud paints that in my hand right now, I put on my concealer. I put it above my lip to conceal my mini mustache. I don't have no shame. We girls, all of us got mustaches, so stop. I can feel y'all judging me through this camera right now. But I don't care. I'm gonna keep doing it. I'm gonna do me, you do you, boo boo. Before this runny futures are on my hand and this cloud paint goes. Alright, beam, it's your turn, girl. And then you got your cute little cheeky uh look. Y'all see that little glow that I got? <laughs> Sorry for the hair change, but I've been feeling myself and these little micro twists that I did, so I'm gonna keep switching up my hair until I find the right one. And this one is the right one. <laughs> Alright, so for now, the next step. Well, I have two of the Halo Scopes. Um, I have Halo Scope in Topaz and Halo Scope in Quartz. Um, I'm not gonna lie, Topaz is my favorite. Um, I'm just gonna do a little swatch on my hand. This is Topaz. And this is Quartz. So what you can do is do with your finger. You wrap it on your finger and then you dab it onto your face like that. Actually, I'm gonna do topaz on this side and I'm gonna do quartz on the other side so you guys can see the difference. You dab it onto your face like that. I like to do it above my cheeks a bit. Quartz. So on this side, I have quartz and on this side, I have topaz. I like them both. So the reason why I like these highlighters is because it gives you kind of a dewy look. And these highlighters can be used with or without makeup on your face. I'm gonna go back up to my eyes. I'm gonna apply the Pro Tip Eyeliner and then there's the Lash Slick. So I like to hold my eye. Again, I am not a makeup artist. Don't come for me. Thank you. like that I'm done with one eye quick and easy like a like drawing it's like drawing on your face but now that I've put on my eyeliner I'm going to now put on the glossier lash slick on one of my eyes so that you can compare and contrast and see the difference okay one thing that I like to do when I put on my eyeliner, my mascara is that I use a setting spray and I spray the brush. Some makeup artists out there showed me that trick. I'm not remembering right now who that makeup artist is, but well, thank you from the bottom of my heart for that trick. All right, here we go, guys. I'll take out my lash leg and I'll spray the brush. And then... Hey guys, so I don't know if you can really see it, but um, I hope that you can see it. Um, this side is done and this side isn't. And this is just using the lash like. I love this mascara, it's really easy to use and 
it makes me feel like I have lashes. Another trick that I've learned also is to use the tip of the brush and brush up on your eyelash if you want to create a longer look. It gives the illusion that you have lashes when you do. This is it, my lashes. <laughs> I got me lashes, guys. So this is the last like I highly, highly, highly recommend that you get this last lick. Before you leave this video, leave your girl some love in the comments. Y'all know I'm on this road to 500 subscribers before the month is up. And I would truly appreciate it if you support your girl. And put that heart, leave that comment, and subscribe to your girl's channel. Show some love if you're loving this video. If you're loving my content on YouTube so far. Alright, so I've already done a video on my Instagram IGTV of me applying my my sky wash um this is eyeshadows so today i'm just going to use my favorite one which is Terra. so i dab it onto my lid like so and i just dab it out these dry quickly and they're smudge free if i can apply this eyeshadow anyone can if I could do this, you could do this. Like, I am not a makeup artist. I'm telling y'all right now. If I could do this joint, so can you. Boom, bam, boom. That's it. Like, I could cry, but I don't want to mess up my makeup. Like, it makes me so happy when Glossier comes out with makeup products that are so easy to use. Like, so easy a caveman could do it. I'm the caveman. I could do it. All right, no break is over, guys. I'm back. Um, so now that that is done and my makeup is done on my eyes, my brows, my face, the next thing I'm going to do is the lips. You can't forget the lips. Eyes, nose, face, lips, hey. These lip glosses are the bomb. The bomb. I love them. It's not your, your lip gloss like back in the day when you were a little kid and you used to have a um, glossy ass lips. Sorry for my language if my parents are watching this video. But um, <laughs> these lip glosses are keepers. Like you would want to get your hands on these babies. This is the red one. This is the red one, guys. This is the red one. I like this one, but the Claire is my favorite. <laughs> so this is a Claire. I like a calm look when I have eyeshadow on because I never know what to do with my lips when I have eyeshadow on. And I don't really use eyeshadow that much. This is the Claire. Um, it's a really... Um, basic lip gloss but it's essential for me because I like lip glosses I'm a lip gloss girl if you're a lip gloss girl put that in the comments that you're a lip gloss girl so I know and I could give you a hey 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 <laughs> and we're gonna move on over to me telling you a little bit more about some glossier products that you need in your life I hope you're not tired of me yet if you're not tired of me yet put it down in the comments right now say I'm not tired of you yet all right Give me some love, give me some parts, something. Next product that I want to show you from Glossier, which is the Glossier U. <sighs> Guys, I love this product so much. Like, if I could hold it next to my heart and sleep with it every night, I would. But I'm not going to do that because I have a whole husband. Okay, I don't need to do that. This product is really good. It smells really good. I'm actually going to put some more right now just because. <sighs> it smells so good. <sighs> Guys, it's so romantic. It's a romantic spray. And because the bottle is so small and it costs so much. And I love it so much. I use it sparingly. So if you choose to get this um, perfume, ladies, use it sparingly. <sighs> it smells so good. This is a true story. I was at a store shopping with Duran, and the sales um, rep, while Duran was trying on his clothes, the sales rep came to me. 
and he was like, um, hi, what perfume are you, you wearing? Because I want to get it for my girlfriend. It smells so good. And I was like, okay. <laughs> I was bad hype. I had to introduce myself. I had to say I was a Glossier rep and let them know, let him know that he can use my link for 10% off, give him that discount, and he was good to go. So, true story. This perfume is everything, like, I'm not lying to y'all. I wouldn't lie to y'all. I think I shared with you all of the necessary Glossier products that I would usually use to get myself ready to go out or whatever the case is. This was not shown, but I used the coconutbalm.com, which is basically a lip balm that you use on your lips to keep them moisturized, to keep them from cracking. You can use this on your skin to keep your hands um, moisturized. I'm actually gonna use some on my skin right now because my hand looks a little ashy, so I just put it on my hand like that. This balm.com has many uses, guys. You can use it as cuticle cream, lip balm, a hand cream like I'm doing right now, all of the above, and it still works. This one smells like coconut and it's so good. I got it here. my hair real quick for the people who are wondering what my micro twist look like there's a road to 500 subscribers I've been just really happy for each subscriber that I've gained like I love and appreciate you guys and I love you taking the time out to watch my little channel like this is my little channel baby like thank you so much from the bottom of my heart well see you on the next video thank you so much for watching bye <laughs>